Today we're gonna to talk about the Nespresso Virtual Next machine. As a quick disclaimer, this is my very first coffee maker that I've ever owned. In fact, my coffee making experience has been limited to the Keurig at my previous job. That being said, Nespresso has a pretty big following in general. I remember the first time that I heard of it when it first came out, I was seeing it in commercials that had George Clooney in it doing, you know, George Clooney things. I could only imagine ever since then how smooth this coffee is for them to hire someone as smooth and suave as he was. Rich, rich. very rich. I would say Latin American temperament. Mm -hmm. Deep mm. and sensual. Yeah, and a delicious aftertaste. You're talking about yeah. Nespresso, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, what else? <laughs> Not to undercut the achievements of Nespresso, but they do have one of the more sustainable practices in the coffee world. And I want to talk about that a little bit more later on. But right now, let's jump into what comes inside the box. The Virtuo Next is Nespresso's newest and smallest model compared to the other previous machines. I'll go into what everything is, how it all works, and how you can make your first cup of coffee. I've already unboxed everything that comes inside your Virtuo Next. As I mentioned, Virtuo Next is the newest and smallest model, so it is a perfect um, option for anyone who doesn't really have a lot of counter space to spare. And it comes in, I believe, 11 different colors. The color that we have here today is the gray color. So to get started, um, what you're gonna get is obviously the machine which is the star of the show you also get this drink tray which basically holds up your cup when you make your coffee there's adjustable notches that you can choose depending on the height of the drink that you are making or you can just choose not to have it if you have um, a really tall cup that you want to use next you have your looks like this is the manual and i believe yeah this is definitely the manual kind of just your general safety and overview you also have a quick start guide here which um, you can choose to follow or just keep watching this video so we can do it together and then last but not least i was pretty excited and i did not expect this to come with the machine but this box here has all of your capsules that you can literally start making coffee with so i believe this comes with um, 11, yeah, 11 capsules of roast and ground coffee and one capsule of decaffeinated roast and ground coffee as well. So that's going to be a cool one to get into. So the first thing you want to do is to take off the container here, which is for your water reservoir. Little bits of dirt and things like that just from storage and obviously transport before you're getting it. So I'm going to go ahead and get this rinsed out, dry it out, and then come right back. Now that it's dry, you're gonna wanna go ahead and place the container on the back and make sure that it snaps back in place. Now that the water tank is clean, we are going to fill it up with fresh water. Now place the lid back and then we are going to plug in the machine. So this is how you open it, I guess. They also advise to get a pretty big cup of water. The only cup that I could find was this because I lost a lot of my glass cups during the move. So I'm just gonna place it underneath here. And then if you push down and turn it to the lock, it should start the preheating process. Or I guess you have to press the machine first. Press it three times. So one, two, three. Something that I wasn't expecting to come with the Nespresso machine is the app integration. What you're gonna to wanna to do is download the Nespresso app which I have here. Then basically we're gonna connect the machine and the app. And that way you can actually control making your drinks, I guess, I don't know. So we're gonna go ahead and go to Nespresso. And then here we're going to click my machine, pair and register your machine. I guess I'm just gonna do it with Wi-Fi. It didn't come with any instructions on what to do with the machine itself. So I'm assuming it just 
gets recognized. So we'll see how long it takes to do this. Machine found. Venus, blah, blah, blah. I'm assuming that's the machine. So it says machine has paired successfully and it does show a picture of my actual um, Virtuo there. So it matches the colors and everything. So I'm assuming we're good to go. I'm gonna hit continue. And register my machine. Activate my warranty coverage. I will do this later. Machine added. Okay, so then I'm gonna go hit machine details. And it tells me kind of the status. So right now, obviously the water tank is empty since we just finished the rinsing. And if you have multiple machines, you can actually pair and register another machine on the next page. So that's pretty cool. Now let's talk about the capsules. As I mentioned earlier, I was pretty surprised that the machine actually came with capsules. I was convinced that they were gonna be a separate purchase, but they actually came with a pretty good amount. And I also have the box again here because they have a lot of information that is actually pertaining the capsules. So right here on top, it tells you a little bit about the sizes that's offered. Depending on the capsule that you choose, it actually determines the amount of drink that you get the flavor and the machine i guess is smart enough to recognize which capsule is already in the machine and it'll brew it to the i guess recipe that nespresso company intended so let's take a look oh, okay yeah so it's i wish there was some sort of like perforation because i thought i was breaking the box but i guess you're supposed to kind of rip the seams open it does have a little guide also on the top as to what comes in the box. Let's see what this is. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, wow. There's lots more capsules that you can purchase on the website and lots of online retailers. But I just want you to take a look at how pretty that looks. Look, it looks like a bunch of chocolates. Cool. Yeah. I think I'm gonna try this one instead. Melozio. Yeah, this is the one that I wanted. Melozio. Focus. All right, we're back at our coffee station. I purposely brought a double wall cup that I got yesterday from Target. As you can see, it still has the sticker on the bottom. And we're gonna place this drink tray, um, cup, base, whatever you wanna call it, maybe to this height. Oh, nope, that's too tall. We're gonna make it here in the bottom. There you go. Fresh water and our cup and then our capsule. We're gonna unlock this here. First. And then it pops up the top. The machine is smart enough to know that this capsule has the specific flavor, the specific settings. Assuming it's because it has these little stripes there on the side, kind of like a QR code. So I'm just gonna place it here in the middle and then you're just gonna pop it close. And I'm assuming that's what pierces the capsule. I'm gonna close that, put some water in the container. You don't have to obviously fill it all the way to the top, but at least enough for the drink. And then I believe we just press it three times. the camera and show you a little bit of a close-up wow well i can tell you it's very satisfying to see it you know in a clear cup and it's really brewed creamy so let's give it a taste yeah, yeah i know but the double wall thingy helps it smells good tastes like coffee <laughs> Yeah, so I, I'm normally going to... I have to have some sort of a creamer or something to offset the black coffee flavor. Got some creamer that we also got from Target yesterday. Did you shake this? A little too much, but that's okay. We're having some cafe. Mm -hmm. 
it's good. I can't wait to make iced coffee. Mm. I'm gonna enjoy this cup a little more and then I'm gonna come back and give you guys my final thoughts. All right, I forgot to talk about this earlier, so this is gonna be a really informal but quick way for me to talk about it. After you're done brewing your coffee and everything has cooled down, you're gonna want to unlock. The capsule will get picked up by these wire arms here and then it gets shot down into the capsule container and then here you can see it's actually in there before i turn on my own espresso machine i've actually read a lot of you know mixed reviews about the virtuo next things going wrong and things like that so i'm excited that nothing wrong happened today and i was able to make this and it is so so good I wanted to talk a little bit about the sustainability about Nespresso and one way they are doing that is the capsules that they come in for each machine they can all be recycled at different Nespresso stores and different recycle centers the easiest way to find the closest location to you is to actually just plug it on their website and then they'll show you locations that will take your used capsules for you and they'll recycle it for you so I think that's really cool one of the reasons why I've been deterred from actually getting my own Keurig I didn't want to be wasting those pods every time that I'm making a cup of coffee and just throwing it in the trash but what's nice is that Nespresso thought about that ahead of time and take care of it for you all in all this has been a really good product and a great gift that I've received for Christmas so I'm very excited that I have this now and this is something that we're gonna be taking with us to our next house but in the meantime it'll help me curb my coffee cravings in the morning now at least I have my own supply and I can make delicious coffee right here if any of you guys are watching who are thinking of purchasing your own Nespresso machine or just was curious to seeing how it works hopefully this video has helped you out if you like this video please give the video a thumbs up and if you um, enjoyed today's review and would like to see more reviews in the future please consider subscribing to the channel we are very close to our 1,000 subscriber mark I would really really appreciate it if you could return the favor and subscribe to the channel and help us out thank you guys again for watching and I will see you guys in the next video